Hi everyone, I am coming back to you today with another video, mukbang, and as you can see, I am eating the Impossible Whopper with onion rings and the Zesty, Zesty sauce, they call it, put these back over here. And I have my big old Sprite. So let me do my, um, I'm going to do my thumbnail. There we go. <laughs> Well, today I had went to work and you know it's so close to the hurricane right now. We're on um let's say Tuesday the third and Dorian is out there just uh tiggling around and taking his own sweet time. So let me say my grace first. Dear kindly Heavenly Father. Thank you for this meal that has been provided for me. Bless the hands that prepared it. Amen. So, we only worked an hour and we were sent home. I had to cash my check because I had to pay my rent. And what you think happened? Banks closed. So, I went to two check cashing places. Too much drama too much money and then the lady check cash in place she said why don't you just deposit the check do you have an account and i was like yeah she said deposit a check and it'll give you option for your money something like that so what ended up happening i went to the bank that i went that i had to go to and um it happened to be two workers was going into the bank i was like are y'all open she said no i said let me ask you a question i said i have a check um, I want to cash it. I want to take the money back out. If I stick it in, would it give me money back? She said yes. She said, long as you don't have no problems bouncing and all of that, and as long as um, you've been with the company over 30 days, I said, oh yeah, I've been a long time. And they said they'll give you up to 300 back. So I stuck that bad baby in there and pulled them $300 out because that's exactly what I needed to go pay my bill. <laughs> Um, the good thing oh my god I was able to pay my bill so big smile on my face but I am sitting here waiting for Damien to do what he gonna do cause he wanted me out already I'm gonna take a bite See how it tastes. Let me try just the meat. Now, I taste a lot of the grillness, but I taste a little bit of the meat and to me, okay, it tastes like a griller. And for those who do not know what a griller is, it's called Morning Star Grillers. They are vegetarian burgers. A lot of us use them who are vegetarian. I am not vegetarian, but I have been in the vegetarian um, atmosphere pretty much my whole entire life. 
I remember I pretty much grew up living with my grandmother. So I remember it's time to go grocery shopping. I used to, I ate so much microwave for food, it was crazy. I would put my little bit of meat stuff in there, but long as it was microwavable, she was all right. But if I had to cook it, Brenda wasn't going for that. Y'all, don't worry about my little sideburn thing. <laughs> it's been raining, so it done shrizzled up. <laughs> but, that's what it tastes like to me. And being that it has all the toppings of a um, it has all the toppings of a Whopper. It makes it taste like it is that Whopper. But being that I know what soybean burger tastes like, it threw it off a little bit. But I was able to detect it. But that's what it tastes like. So I'm fine. Because I love my grillers. I know my granny, she really didn't do grillers and stuff until later in life. The first time I ever remember eating a griller was when I used to go to my best friend's house. I used to go to my best friend's house. Hardly ever. <laughs> but when I could get over there, you know, once she moved, because we used to live like right there in the same neighborhood, like maybe 300 feet away from each other. But when she moved to Orlando area, because I was in the Altamont area, she was in the Orlando area. Um, that's when I didn't see her as much. So, the weekend is that my granny had to work. I would just beg and beg and beg. We both be begging to spend the night so that I can hang out with her. And I remember her dad used to, they used to make grillers and, you know, red beans and rice. Or, no, rice and peas. They used to make it. And it was good. <laughs> it was good. Hmm. I am just beat down from trying to get that check cash. <laughs> but it worked out. Hmm. I'm going to try to eat this burger, but eat the whole thing. <laughs> I had to promise y'all there. <laughs> that could be a little too much more. And I don't want nobody gave me large. I should have told them no, small. <laughs> um, eat that one. <laughs> Just chilling, waiting for Damien. So, what they sing on? We supposed to feel Damien sometime tonight, four day in the morning. Unfortunately, I'm gonna be by myself because my boyfriend has to work tonight. So I'll be okay. This will be my first hurricane alone. <laughs> but you know, so it's just crazy. And I finally was able to go get me one. Hmm. We don't have that many bird kings around my area. I mean, 
get a distance away. And this was in the area when I went. Go to go and pass my checkout. Um, but again, this would be something good for a person who's a vegetarian. The only thing is a lot of vegetarian that I know they will not want their food cooked on something that meat was on. That's the only thing. So if this meat was cooked on uh, non meat was cooked uh, or something that um the meat was cooked on then people might have a problem with it that's vegetarian. And this is a sprite if I didn't say it. Ooh. I should have cut this bad baby in half. I should have cut it in half and put it up for later. Because I ain't even digged into these yet. Because they gave me so many. I'm just so used to getting. I'm. This is what I'm used to getting. When I go to Burger King, I get a junior of what it's called Whopper Junior. I get a Whopper Junior with the, the um, onion rings in my drink. That's all I get. I don't eat that much. Mm. Mm. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. But I am going to do um, a video on Embryology the team. What do we really need for a storm? And I'm going to call it the Florida area. Because sometimes we buy a lot of stuff we really don't need it. But I must tell you what I would buy if there was a storm in my area, like what I'm doing now. But. I'm going to turn the video. I still got a lot of these. I'm not going to eat all of them. I'm probably going to put my burger up for later. Because I'm not that hungry. I just wanted to taste it. See if it really tastes like a burger. Or you know what and to me like I said it tastes like a griller from what you call it star star I forgot what it's called <laughs> but from that company I think it's morning star that's what it is morning star I kept having a farm in my mouth but morning star which is good to me. Even I mean, I eat meat, but I can still eat a morning star. It's good. I'm so used to eating it while my, you know, my grandmother, straight vegetarian. I mean, she might have snuck and ate some meat, and that was when she got older. Like, we was the one parent preparing her food, and she'll steal our food because <laughs> she had Alzheimer's. <laughs> That's the only time she ever ate any type of meat. And my grandmother lived till she was 90 years old. And, you know, unfortunately, she had to say goodbye to us. I remember I made her a bracelet. And it says, I think it says, I love Granny, because her name was Granny. That's what we called her. She didn't want nobody calling her that. She was thinking about Little Mama, because her mama's name was Big Mama. So she was thinking about Little Mama. And this one, my daughter called me Little Mama. 
uh, it's a little mama. Yeah, she called me little mama or shorty. It's so crazy, and she not even taller than me. But um, I ended up calling her granny because I was her first grandchild. No, I take that back. She had a grandson that's older than me. But I was her first granddaughter. And I called her granny. So, it's weird because my grandbaby is two years old. And I thought, she ain't gonna call me no granny. And, and she knows. I said, what's my name? And she said, G-Mama. I'm like, what that stand for? Glam Mama. I said, hello. <laughs> I might not be glammed up today, but that's all right. I got the eyeliner, I mean, my, my eyebrows on and eyeliner, but I won't put all that stuff on because it's raining. That's why my hair look a mess. It's time to take this stuff out, but I'm going to try to hold on a little while longer. And, you know, I'm looking for the right, you know, hairdo because I have a surprise for October. If everything works out, I have a surprise for October. But it's been a pleasure. Speaking with y'all, or y'all watching my video, whichever way you want to say it, but, <laughs> um, if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button, thumbs it up, because I know you liked it, and hit that notification so that you will be notified of all my upcoming videos, future videos, whichever way you want to say it, make sure you hit the all button when it's the bell, because if you hit the middle one, it'll show you some videos. And that's why my son was like, Mom, I'm not even getting your videos. I said, I see why. But we fixed that. So, thank everyone and all those who are out there, especially, let me, let me back up a little bit. The ones who had to do with um, the hurricane and... Um, it's at, the top, it's at the tip of my tongue, Bahamas. I give them a special prayer. And I just hope God just work it out. I heard some people had died. And that's just sad. The one man had been fixing on his house. And he fell, um, you know, trying to cover up the window. He fell and died. And I'm like, all we're trying to do is just prepare for this, and we have to end up losing our life, which is not cool at all. You know, I, I kept saying I wanted to go up, but then you got to think about it. If you want it to go up, it's going to end up hurting somebody else. So, I'm just hoping that it done did all the damage for us hurting someone that it's done that it's going to do, and I'm hoping. That it does turn to a certain degree where maybe it might go up Florida and then up the outs outskirts of um, <clears throat> Florida, Georgia, South Carolina, North Carolina and go out in the water where we might get a lot of rain but not where it's going to cause somebody life. That's what I don't want it to do. So I pray that everyone gets through this safely. And y'all have a great evening. Today is Tuesday. So hopefully everything will work out in all of our favors. So this is to everyone that's dealing with this story. Because he's a hot mess. And the one I know for real is a hot mess. <laughs> so they got the right name for the right person. <laughs> so y'all have a great evening. Until we see each other again, bye.